بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم دس از اسد یعقوب اینڈ ونس اگین ہیئر آئی ایم وی آر سالونگ ون آئلس ریڈنگ ٹیسٹ اے کمپلیٹ ٹیسٹ وی آر ایکچولی کریکنگ آئلس ریڈنگ ٹوگیدر ایوری ٹائم یو واچ مائی ویڈیو آفٹر واچنگ مائی ویڈیو یو ول فیل مچ بیٹر یو ول فائنڈ اینڈر کریک ان یور نیگیٹو بلیف آف آئلس Uh, or your negative belief about IELTS reading and I have to crack your negative belief about IELTS reading and that belief is IELTS reading is so tough so we will crack that belief and while cracking that belief we will have to crack IELTS reading as well and we will do this together and at the end like you know when something snaps or when something cracks there's a loud noise there'll be the loud noise and then you will say IELTS reading is a piece of cake for me so let's make Make IELTS reading a piece of cake for you. I actually like piece of cake very much with a hot coffee. <laughs> okay. So anyways, uh, the next type of questions which we are going to do that is in uh, section 3 IELTS reading. We are doing academic IELTS reading section 3 and it is also classification. There are three categories and we got to see the statements whether those statements classify in category A or B or C. This is what we are going to do. Now I'll explain it further. Let's go to the book and we go there and we see how this question type is done. I have already solved the tests for you. So now I'll just tell you how I found this answer, where I went to find this type of answer. Let's go to the book. Okay, now we've got questions 27 to 31 and it's again a classification question. Classify the following as being a result of. Now you got to classify the following. Following means the statements as being a result of. Now whatever the statements are, they are the result of. Result of what? Result of fair trade policies, result of ethical trade policies, and the result of being a country being poor. All these statements are the result. They are the result of three things. One is fair trade policy, second is ethical trade policies, and third is a country being poor. So you need to see where they are talking about fair trade policy. One or two options will be there, but actually it's a good idea to scan for the option and there you need to find whether it is fair trade policy, ethical trade policy or a country being poor. Now let's see question number 27. Manufactured goods are obtainable at a lower price. Now here lower price. Price is the main thing. Manufactured goods are obtainable at a lower price than elsewhere. Manufactured goods are obtainable at a lower price than elsewhere. Now we got to keep in mind manufactured goods, obtainable, lower price than elsewhere and then we got to see what can be the answer. So let's come back and we got to scan. Yes, there they are talking about price. Today fixing a fair price remains at the center of the international commerce. It means you will find the answer in this paragraph because in this paragraph they are talking about price. Although they are talking about price here also, in most cases the purpose of setting a suitable price is to sell the maximum number of units. There also they are talking about price. But anyways we just go on with this. So these two paragraphs are about price. Fixing the price and all that stuff, price uh, deal from point of view of the seller, market research must determine the price at which the goods will be sold. This may vary greatly from country to country and this may vary greatly from country to country and people are often surprised to see exactly the same item for sale at two or three times the price it sells price again. It sells for in another country. Taxation and local government controls are sometimes behind this but often it comes down to the fact that people in poor countries now see that people in poor countries simply cannot afford to pay the same amount of money as those in rich countries. So these are the things a seller has to bear in mind when preparing a price list for goods in each country, poor country. Now see that 
द स्टेटमेंट इज मैन्युफैक्चरिंग गुड्स आर ऑप्टेनेबल एट अ लोअर प्राइस लोअर प्राइस देव मैंशन देन एल्सवेयर देन एल्सवेयर मीन्स अदर कंट्रीज मैन्युफैक्चर गुड्स आर ऑप्टेनेबल एट अ लोअर प्राइस देन एल्सवेयर आई कम बैक हियर अगेन दे से इट कम्स डाउन टू द फैक्ट दैट पीपल इन पुअर कंट्रीज सिंपली कैन नॉट अफोर्ड टू पे द सेम अमाउंट ऑफ मनी एज दोज इन रिच कंट्रीज these are the things a seller has to bear in mind when preparing a price list for goods in each country so the question is manufactured goods are obtainable at a lower price than elsewhere and this is being a result of a country being poor so c is going to be the answer okay now let's go on question number 28 harm to producers of raw materials is minimized we got to see what is it a result of whether it is the result of fair trade policies ethical trade policies or a country being poor harm to producers of raw materials is minimized harm to producers and then raw materials is minimized we got to just look for the words harm producers raw materials and minimized let's come back uh okay we've been through this paragraph and at least that was the case until relatively recently when to the great surprise of many companies started trading without profit as their main objective ethical trade began now they are talking about ethical trade and it's one of the options ethical trade began as an attempt to cause as little damage now harm damage and harm ethical trade began as an attempt to cause as little damage as possible to the producers of raw materials that's it okay to producers of raw materials so ethical trade began as an attempt to cause as little damage as possible to the producers of raw material harm to producers of raw materials is minimized that is ethical trade policies this is actually the result of ethical trade policies you can see this again if you want to it's just here ethical trade began as an attempt to cause as little damage as possible as little damage as possible means minimize as little as means minimize to the producers of raw materials and manufactured goods in poor countries okay now let's go on human rights are respected human rights actually that's the clue word human rights are respected as a result of what fair trade policies ethical trade policies and a country being poor now they are talking about human rights so my guess is ethical trade ethical trade policy because you know human rights and ethics that has got a closer link but anyways we'll try to find it okay let's go on this movement but put pressure this movement put pressure on the industry to see to it that working conditions and the human right now you got to scan for the word human right this movement this movement means ethical trade this movement ethical trade and the words this is called referencing this is a very good example of referencing this movement now you'll not be able to link it so you got to link this movement with ethical trade this movement put pressure on the industry to see to it that working conditions and human rights were not damaged by the need for poor so as a result of what ethical trade so the answer for question number 29 human rights are respected that is the result of ethical trade policies let's go on number 30 land is not used to produce food for the local population land is not used to produce food for the local population now we got to see whether it is a result of fair trade ethical trade or a country being poor land is not used to produce food for the local population now let's go on we found 29 here now let's come to 30 okay yeah so we'll find the words like land produce food not for local population let's find it here there have been many examples throughout the developing world where local producers were forced by economic pressure to supply cash crops such as tea coffee wow to supply cash crops such as tea coffee and cotton to major industries 
now there have been many examples throughout the developing world now developing world means a country being poor the developing world where local producers were forced by economic pressure to supply cash crops such as tea coffee and cotton to major industries these people are frequently not in a position to fix their prices and are often forced by market conditions to sell for a price and all that now what is that land is not used to produce food for food they have used the word cash crops such as tea coffee cotton although cotton is not a food but still it comes in the same category land is not used to produce food for the local population where they have written forced by economic pressure to supply cash crops such as tea coffee and cotton to major industries means the other countries okay so the answer is going to be a country being poor because they use the word if you come back they use the word the developing world the developing world means a country being poor so land is not used to produce food for the local population option c a country being poor okay let's go on question number 31 the local community has more chance of survival local community has more chance more chance of survival where as a result of fair trade policy as a result of ethical trade policy or as a, a country being poor so let's see local community and communities yeah fair trade policies we found the word communities here so first you need to scan for the word community and remember the questions and answers they are going to be in the same order they would be scattered now for example we found the answer of question number 30 over here 31 over here if we just come back and we can see 29 is here 28 is here 27 is here so it's basically like that but they are in order 27 28 29 and after that we've got 30 and 31 let's read uh, fair trade policies differ from ethical uh, trade policies in that they take the process a strange further a stage further sorry if I misread anything please excuse me for that because I'm doing it quickly where ethical policies are designed to keep the damage uh, to a minimum fair trade organizations now they're talking about fair trade okay so you may separate it fair trade organizations actually work to improve conditions among producers and their communities this sentence fair trade organizations actually work to improve conditions among producers and their communities now what is that uh, the local community it's 30 uh, yeah the local community has more chance of survival the local community has more chance of survival what is that fair trade organizations actually work to improve conditions among producers and their communities fair trade organizations view sustainability sustainability and survival sustainability as a key aim sustainability and here the local community has more chance of survival more chance of survival and if you come back here free trade organizations view sustainability as a key aim key aim and more chance sustainability survival see that IELTS reading is actually the game of uh, synonyms actually sustainability sustainability is going to go with survival as a key aim and for key aim we've got has more chance and they're doing it for the local community so that's why fair trade policies a will be the right answer okay we are back from the book so how was that difficult don't worry don't worry when Asad Yaakob is here no need to worry about anything okay so we did this all together if you like this video hit on the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel I deserve it actually okay and uh, apart from this I run two more channels one is Asad Yaakov vlogs there you can find more about me about my lifestyle about my other activities and there is another channel Asad Yaakov languages there I teach English and some foreign languages like French Spanish German and Italian you can subscribe my other two channels as well and I also teach IELTS online if you want to join my online IELTS classes 
for that also you can contact me my whatsapp number is given here and i will teach you ielts personally online class does not mean i'll play an audio or send you a video no i will come online you will come online we'll be having a live call on skype or whatsapp and on that call i'll teach you ielts i'll send you the material and all that stuff so i charge for that there is the fee for online classes if you want to join online classes you can contact me asad yakub wishes you all the best and a fantastic bench score in ielts reading take care see you soon